Welcome to your tutorial on how to configure multiple locations. This section will not apply to you if you have not purchased additional locations. If you are interested in adding locations to your profile, please go ahead and contact us and you can add additional locations for a 20% discount. In this section here, you will be able to add additional office locations. So we're using the sample profile here. You can see that sample has an address in Albany, in New York City, as well as Troy. So Troy and Albany are physically near each other. We're going to pretend that they actually have an office location in each one of those. So you can see here that the Albany office address has been set up. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to choose an address. I'm going to add an address for Troy. So just quickly enter in. Troy and then enter in the state. Make sure that I have a zip and at, uh, enter in a telephone number, especially if it's different than the previous number. So what I've done there is you can see I've added this Troy address down here. But what's important to note is that when people are searching for me and they find me in Troy, Currently, the Central Avenue address, the address from Albany, is assigned to that location. So I just want to make sure that I click on this and assign the correct office location. Now, what I'm going to do next is a really neat feature that we offer at Theravive. I'm going to add what's called a virtual address. And so I'm going to say that I've picked to purchase a location in New York City because I have an e-counseling practice. And I want to be found by zip code results in New York City. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to enter in a virtual address. So down here, I'm going to add an address. And the only field that I'm going to fill out is that of the zip code. So to find a zip code that I want to be found by, especially in New York is a great example because there's so many zip codes, um, I'm going to choose that I want to be found by the zip 10016. And zip code searches are based on proximity. So if somebody's searching for 10017, I will come up, but I may not be the first result if I'm choosing 10016. So now I'm going to add this address here. And now you can see that I have this virtual address. It sort of shows up quite blank, but don't worry, it has been saved. And I now will come up in search results. You don't need to do anything attaching the um, virtual address to this location. It's going to show both of my office locations actually still on my profile, uh, both of my physical office locations, and I will be found by that zip, result, zip code search. It's a strategic way to help with your marketing so that if, for example, I even wanted to list, I had an office location in Albany, yet I didn't have an office location in Troy, which is a very nearby town, and I knew that I could draw referrals from that location, I may choose that I want to purchase a, a space in Troy and add a virtual address. My Albany address would show up for them as a physical address, so they would know which office they're actually going to but they would find me strategically higher up in zip code search results. So we do offer that as a feature on Theravive. We have various uh, different accounts that you can choose from. There's additional information down here about how to add your virtual address. And um, you can always contact us if you are interested in um, enhancing your profile, adding additional locations, and uh, increasing your reach. So thank you for viewing this tutorial on configuring your multiple locations. And if you have any further questions in regards to how to set up your profile or the features that Theravive offers, please continue to watch the tutorials that we've provided.